Okay, we're going to try to make this a quick one. What we're going to do today is use MPV or VLC, hopefully, to stream some live videos from Facebook. Obviously, you can go to Facebook and stream them, but the player on Facebook uh, doesn't really have any controls, and using these applications, one, I just prefer, I like MPV, um, but also gives you the opportunity to um, give it a, a little more functionality, like pausing and somewhat rewinding. Uh, also, this also would lead to the ability to download the videos as well if you wanted. Uh, so let's go ahead, facebook.com forward slash watch forward slash live. This is the first video that comes up. I'm going to open up my developer's console uh, in a Chromium-based browser, Chrome, I'm using Brave, Control-Shift-I or F12, Firefox, I think it's also F12. Um, and then what you're going to do is go to your network tab, and normally you would go to media to see what videos are playing uh, or audio files. But if we go to all and click play on this video here, and again, this is just the video that they're suggesting, and then in the filter I type in MPD, you can see that we have some options here. And I'm just gonna click the first one, say copy, copy link address, and then I'll just type in my shell VLC, give it that URL in quotations. And hopefully here in a second, it will start streaming. It's a little blurry at first, but there we go. It upgraded to a higher quality. Now, uh, you can do the same with MPV. Uh, you, I believe it does use YouTube DL in the background to get the URLs, so give that a try. Uh, so I've had a little bit of hit and miss with this MPV. I'll give that URL. It sometimes takes a little while. Let's see. Yes, it's taking a little while. Um, there we go, and it's loading. I think, uh, there you go, even lists uh, which version it's playing. It so shows you different options in the shell here, and which one's playing. And again, so now, unlike Facebook, I can pause this. I can unpause it. Uh, you can see down here that we're 14 seconds in, and it's buffering at three seconds. We're about to run out of buffer here. Uh, I guess maybe my internet's running slow, but uh, it, it will eventually catch up. But I can always rewind at least to the point where I started streaming. Uh, I can't rewind before that in this particular case. Um, but yeah, that's the, I have had a few videos where I go to use it in MPV and it does not work. Um, and then I tried it in VLC and it does. Again, it's using YouTube DL in the background, so there might be you know an update available for that by the time this video goes out. Uh, you can also, that same URL, if I was to use curl or wget to get that, it will give me an, like basically an XML file with some information on the video. So there you can actually look at some of the links and you could probably deduce from there which videos you're going to, uh, what URLs you want for the videos. Uh, but both of them should, again, work by default, uh, VLC or MPV and just in quotations the video URL that we grab from the shell. There we go. And again, uh, you open up your console, or you open up your, your web browser, Control Shift I or F12, go to Network, All, MPD, and then just grab any of these URLs and paste it into your application. That is it. I hope you found this useful, and I thank you for watching, and I hope that you have a great day.